Hi there. So I've started recently using Logic Pro for my composition, um, not because it's any better than Cubase, not that it's uh, any more functionality, um, but I just find it quite a comfortable workspace. Uh, the single screen mode works well for me. But recently I found a rather cool feature that I did not know existed. Maybe I'm just slow on the uptake, but this is a, an amazing feature. I'm just going to run through it very quickly. So I've got four instances of Spitfire Audio's BBC Symphony Orchestra loaded here on four channels, inst one, inst two, inst three, and inst four. And these are the violins, violin twos, uh, celli, and basses. And that's great, I can switch between them and I can record on all channels and, uh, and record what I want to record. But every time I want to go into the other instrument, I have to click down over here, activate the plugin, move it around the screen so it's in the right place, change anything I want to change, and then close the plugin. Um, admittedly, I'm only using a small proportion of my screen for this recording, but still, uh, even with a, uh, a 4K screen, these plugins occupy quite a lot of space if you want to be able to read the writing. So, Logic thought about this, and they've created this little button here, the Link button. Now what it does is that it just keeps this little window here for all of my instruments. So if I click on Instrument 1, there we are, it's loaded up Violins 1 into this plugin window. If I click on Instrument 2, it's loaded Violins 2 into this plugin window. Instrument 3, Violas. Instrument 4, Celli. So that is as simple as it is. So what you can do now is you can put this window, I mean, if I want to, I can make it a little bit smaller and just slot it down the bottom of my screen here. And as I'm going through each of my tracks and recording my instruments, this plugin window will link between all four. And if I resize them all independently, the plugin window stays there. And this works for all other VST instruments. So if I add a, another VST instrument here, I'm gonna add a software instrument track there it is, it automatically switches to this new instant down there. So this is a really cool little function. Um, I didn't know it existed. I'm very glad that Logic have put this in here and it's going to be uh, a real time saver.